Good afternoon and welcome to the reading of the book of the prophet Jeremiah chapter 4 and chapter 5. Chapter 4 has 31 verses and chapter 5 has 31 verses. So, chapter 4. If thou will return, O Israel, saith the Lord, return unto me. If thou wilt put away thine abominations from my sight, then shalt thou not remove, and thou shalt swear the Lord liveth in truth, in judgment, and in righteousness, and the nations shall bless themselves in him, and in him shall they glory. For thus saith the Lord to the men of Judah and Jerusalem, Break up your fallow ground, and sow not among thorns. Circumcise yourself to the Lord, and take away the foreskins of your heart, ye men of Judah, and inhabitants of Jerusalem. Let my fury come forth like fire, and burn that none can quench it, because of the evil of your doings. Declare ye in Judah, and publish in Jerusalem, and say, Blow ye the trumpet in the land, cry, Gather together, and say, Assemble yourself, and let us go to the different cities. Set up a standard towards Sion, retire, set, stay not, for I will bring evil from the north, and a great destruction. The lion is come from his ticket, and the destroyer of the Gentiles is on the way. He is gone forth from his place to make the land desolate, and thy city shall be laid waste without an inhabitant. For this, gird you with sackcloth, lament and howl, for the fierce anger of the Lord is not turned back from us. And it shall come to pass at that day, says the Lord, that the heart of the king shall perish, and the heart of the princes, and the priest shall be astonished, and the prophets shall wonder. Then said I, Ah, Lord God, surely thou hast greatly deceived this people and Jerusalem, saying, Ye shall have peace, whereas the soul reacheth unto the soul. At that time shall it be said to this people and to Jerusalem, A dry wind of the high places in the wilderness toward the daughter of my people, not to fan, not to cleanse. Even a full wind from those places shall come unto me, nor also will I give sentence against them. Behold, he shall come up at clouds, and his chariot shall be as a whirlwind. His horses are swifter than eagles. Woe unto us, for we are spoiled. O Jerusalem, wash thine heart from wickedness, that thou mayest be saved. How long shall thy vain thoughts lodge within thee? For a voice declared from Dan, and publisheth affliction from Mount Ephraim. Make ye mention to the nations, behold, publish against Jerusalem, that watchers come from a far country, and give out their voice against the cities of Judah. As keepers of a field are they against her roundabout, because she hath been rebellious against me, says the Lord. Thy way and thy doings have procured these things unto thee. This is thy wickedness, because it is bitter, because it reacheth unto thy heart. My bowels, my bowels, I am pained at my very heart. My heart maketh a noise in me. I cannot hold my peace, because thou hast heard, O my soul, the sound of the trumpet, the alarm of war. Destruction upon destruction is cried. The whole land is spoiled. Suddenly are my tents spoiled, and my curtains in a moment. How long shall I see the standard? and hear the sound of trumpet, for my people is foolish. They have not known me, they are sottish children, and they have no understanding. They are wise to do evil, but to do good they have no knowledge. I beheld the earth, and lo, it was without form and void, and the heavens, and they had no light. I beheld the mountains, and lo, they trembled, and all the hills moved lightly. I beheld, and lo, there was no man, and all the birds of heaven were fled. I beheld, and lo, the fruitful place was a wilderness, and all the cities thereof were broken down in the presence of the Lord, and by his fierce anger. For thus says the Lord God, The whole land shall be desolate, yet will I not make a full end. For this shall the earth mourn, the heavens above be black, because I have spoken it, I have purposed it, and will not repent, neither will I turn back from it. The whole city shall flee for the noise of the horsemen and the bowmen. They shall go into tickets and climb upon the rocks. Every city shall be forsaken, and not a man shall dwell therein. But when thou art spoiled, what wilt thou do? Though thou close thyself with crimson, though thou dex thyself with ornaments of gold, though thou rendest thy face with painting, in vain shall thou make thyself fair. Thy lovers will despise thee, they will seek thy life. For I have heard a voice as of a woman in travail, and anguish as of her that bringeth forth her first child, the voice of the daughter of Sion, and bewaileth herself, that spreadeth her hands, saying, Woe is me now, for my soul is wearied because of murderers. Chapter 5 Run ye and to and fro 
through the streets of Jerusalem in see now and know, and seek in the broad places thereof, if he can find a man, if there be any that execute the judgment, that seeketh the truth, and I will pardon it. And though they say, The Lord liveth, surely they swear falsely. O Lord, art not thine eyes upon the truth? Thou hast stricken them, but they have not grieved. Thou hast consumed them, but they have refused to receive connection. They have made their faces harder than a rock. They have refused to return. Therefore I said, Surely these are poor. They are foolish, for they know not the way of the Lord, nor the judgment of their God. I will get me unto the great men, and will speak unto them, for they have known the way of the Lord, and the judgment of their God. But these have altogether broken the yoke, and burst the bonds. Wherefore, a lion out of the forest shall slay them, and a wolf of the evening shall spoil them. A leopard shall watch over the cities. Every one that goeth without dens shall be torn, torn in pieces, because the transgressions are many, and the backs have forsaken me, and sown by them that are not gods. When I have fed them to the full, they committed adultery, and assembled them themselves by the troops in the harlots' houses. They were as fed horses in the morning, evening one neighed after his neighbor's wife. Shall I not visit for these things, saith the Lord? And shall not my soul be avenged on a nation as this? Go ye upon her walls and destroy, but make not a full end. Take away her battlements. Nevertheless, in those days, says the Lord, I will not make a full end of you. And it shall come to pass when he shall say, Wherefore did the Lord our God all do all these things to us? Then shall thou answer them, Like as ye have forsaken me, and served strange gods in your land, so shall ye serve strangers in a land that is not yours. Declare this in the house of Jacob, and publish it in Judah, saying, Hear now of this, O foolish people, and without understanding, which have eyes and see not, which have ears and hear not. Fear not me, says the Lord. Will ye not tremble at my presence, which have placed the sand for the bound of the sea by a perpetual decree, that it, I cannot pass it? And though the waves thereof toss themselves, yet can they not prevail. Though they roar, yet can they not pass over it. But this people had hath a revolting and a rebellious heart. They are revolted and gone. Neither say they, they in their heart, Let us now fear the Lord our God, that giveth rain, both the former and the latter. In his season, he reserveth unto us the appointed weeks of the harvest. Your iniquities have turned away these things, and your sins have withheld and good things from you. For among my people are found wicked men. They lay wait, as he setteth snares. They set a trap, they catch them. As a cage is full of birds, so are their houses full of deceit. Therefore, they are become great and waxen rich. They are waxen fat, they shine. Yes, they overpass the deeds of the wicked. They judge not the cause, the cause of the fatherless, yet they prosper. And the right of the needy do they not judge. Shall I not visit for these things, says the Lord? Shall not my soul be avenged on such a nation as this? A wonderful and horrible thing is committed in the land. The prophets prophesy falsely, and the priests bear rule by their means. And my people love to have it so. And what will he do 